Good day everyone. Welcome to Teacher Julie channel. Hello everyone. We have our new lesson in Science 8 which is all about classification of humans. This will be the first quarter topic, week 6 and day 1. And this lesson is under the Matatag curriculum. For the objectives, by the end of the lesson, 80% of the learners will be able to First is to distinguish the characteristics among bacteria, archaea, and eukaryotes The second one is correctly label diagrams depicting the key characteristics of each domain And the third one is to appreciate the diversity of life on Earth and the organized system used to study and categorize living organisms based or by answering the guide questions. In activating the prior knowledge for the short review, present these diagrams to the class and instruct the students to write down the general characteristics of each of the three domains of life. For the lesson purpose, the students will accomplish the activity called Me, Myself, and I. So let the students draw and label their own body, highlighting features that make them unique as individuals. For unlocking of content area vocabulary, humans are unique compared to other organisms because of our advanced cognitive abilities, physical structure, and social abilities. But why? Because human belongs to class mammalia. Class mammalia is a taxonomic classification within animal kingdom that includes mammals. Mammals are characterized by several distinct features including warm-blooded or endothermic, having hair of fur of their bodies, giving birth to live young with few exemptions, and producing milk to nourish their offspring. Typically, they have specialized teeth adapted to various diets and possess highly developed brains which contribute to their diverse behaviors and adaptability to different environments. The next one is the order primate. So humans are classified under the order primate because we share numerous anatomical, psychological, and behavioral characteristics with other members of the group. This includes features such as grasping hands with opposable thumb, forward-facing eyes for binocular vision, complex social structure, and relatively large brains.